Dubai, the most luxurious city in the world. Whenever Dubai comes to our mind, we think that the most luxurious and expensive place in the world. But let me clear some myths about Dubai that it is the most luxurious place in the world, but it's not expensive at all. Usually people think that they need a lot of money to visit Dubai, but let me clear, these are all are myths. You can visit in Dubai on a very small budget. This whole information is based on my personal experience. So first of all, we'll talk about accommodation. If you want an economical accommodation, you can share a room with some person that will only cost you around 700 to 800 dirhams only and you can get this room in international city, Dera, Burjaman or Al Karama. These all areas are best to live as you can find groceries and restaurants and especially if you're from Pakistan or India, you can find desi food. Also, you can get easy access to public buses, metro trains and taxis. The next thing you need to travel around the city is the car or metro. If you have your home country license, then you can drive a car in Dubai on your international per driving permit. You can get your international driving permit from your home country. You can rent a small hatchback car like this, starting from as low as 40 dirhams per day. If you don't have your home country license, don't worry, you can use metro. The next main thing you need is food. You can get cheap desi food for starting as low as 10 dirhams per meal and if you talk about uh, fast food like famous brands that is KFC, McDonald's and etc. You can get them for as low as 14 dirhams per meal. And if you want to try Arabic food, you can get as low as 6 dirham per meal. You can get a chicken shawarma only in 6 dirhams. You can get this karak tea only for 1 dirham. Now the main things come that you have to explore the city. So you need to find tourist spots that, that are absolutely free. Yes, you can visit them with 0 dirhams. And there are some areas you can visit with uh, zero dirhams. That are that is Al Sif. You can visit uh, mall that is uh, Marina Mall, Nakheel Mall, Dubai Mall, Mall of Emirates. You can also visit beaches, which are uh, which includes uh, Jumeirah Beach, uh, Al Mamzer Beach, Kite Beach, and you can visit the uh, most beautiful walk. I can say just the JBR walk. You can visit Marina as well. And you should definitely visit city center. Their structures are very beautiful. You can also visit the place where I'm standing. It is the, basically, it, this area is Palm Jumeirah. And where I'm standing is Boardwalk. And it has amazing view. You can also visit Last Exit. It is like an open air food court. And you can visit the most famous Chinese mart. That is Dragon Mart. You can have the view of N Dubai, that is the Dubai Eye, the world's biggest eye, for free from Blue Water Island. You can book water rides or cruise for as low as 25 dirham that include food as well. You can also visit some places with small budget like their entry ticket is uh, as lo low as 15 dirhams per entry. Nowadays, Global Village is open and uh, I think you should visit Global Village. Basically, it is a cultural uh, theme event. You can also watch a movie for as low as 35 dirhams. You can also visit Desert Safari. Different companies are offering different packages, but uh, they are starting from as low as 35 dirhams only. Those who want to enjoy nightlife, they can also visit cafes, clubs, pubs, and bars. According to my calculation, this whole trip will cost you around 3500 to 4500 dirhams, and it is the price for per person. These are the few things that you can do in Dubai, but still there are a lot of other things that you can do in Dubai. And uh, Dubai just never disappoints you, and I'm sure you will enjoy your trip. So, what are you waiting for? Habibi, come to Dubai. Mm -hmm.